my name is Adela Papatz. I'm Global Ambassador for Westminster Business School and as a part of Global Ambassadors Challenge designed by Association of MBAs or AMBA as we call it, I'm here today to talk to you about the leadership for 21st century. It's 9th of March 2012. We are filming here in London, one of the world's leading business and financial centers and also one of the most exciting cities in the world, a city that has been known to thrive through change which uh, brings us to the topic of change, which is actually one of the current buzzwords, because in order for businesses to survive today, they must embrace change. That is the reason why business leaders for 21st century should be first and foremost change agents for their organizations. External environment that businesses now operate in today are typically uncertain uh, with a lot of institutional pressures that have been stronger than ever, uh, economic trends that have been uh, uh, adverse and with all these circumstances it it's really important for business leaders for 21st centuries to be able to recognize potential threats and potential risks. Third thing I want to talk about is uh, actually spotting and developing talent. Um, good business leaders, they know that uh, success is actually uh, succeeding through others, through their teams. And they're always on the lookout for the right talent. Uh, as a final thought, uh, which I want to discuss today, is that uh, business leaders for 21st century should be ethical, because only ethical leaders can run ethical uh, and sustainable organizations. Um, uh, there have been a lot of short-term instant successes around us, but in order to be there for the long haul, uh, businesses should be properly run, which means uh, respecting uh, corporate governance and uh, also um, all the good management principles. So this was my take on leadership for 21st century. If you want to share your own ideas on the subject, you can email me on this email or connect with me on LinkedIn. Thank you.